Even geniuses have problems. Mm -hmm. I, I haven't met a problem-free person. Some people are very good about um, hiding that. Some people are unwilling to talk about that or share that, which I think it, 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 it does a disservice. It's the Instagram of real life, right? Instagram is this amazing storytelling platform where you get to curate who you are to the world. And that's 99% of the time not true. Not talking about our own flaws means that we're curating ourselves in the public eye. And I think that with the good, there's a tremendous amount of opportunity to become softer and better. Mm. You know, it's not just like, oh my God, you're so good at this. It's like, well, fuck. I go to bed at night hating who I am. Like, that's just real life. And there's mornings I wake up and I'm like overwhelmed with gratitude with where I'm at. It's a very strong yin yang. Mm, big polarity there. It's huge. And like, the reality of it is, and I always tell this to people, and I believe this, if you like where you're at in life, then you have to embrace all the fabrics that have woven that together. I love where I'm at in life. I love my wife deeply. I love my sons. I love my company. I love where I live. I, like, I, I am overwhelmed with, like, my life has turned out exponentially better than I could have ever imagined, ever in my life. But there's a lot of demons that I still hold on to. And I don't know, again, like I said, I, I haven't been able to, at least at, bring me back in 10 years and maybe something <laughs> has changed, but I haven't been able to let go of that. 